Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to GTA 5 Online. We have a new vehicle, and it's the Audi R8. Otherwise known as really the Audi R10, because it has a V10, but who cares? A new Audi R8 is here, and it's at the dealership, and we're snagging the dealership version. It's the first time I'm doing this, buying straight from the dealership. This is the first time I've bought a car from here. What is that? Oh, that's the submarine car. Yeah, I don't care. We're here for this, <laughs> the Audi R8. Inspect this thing. Pretty good set. I'm pretty sure it's in sports category, even though it should be in supers, but we'll see. I'm, I, that's what I saw, but we will see. This thing looks good. Domestic Japanese European. Jackal Racing number 11. This thing looks good. It looks pretty good. It looks exactly like the car. Like they, I swear they just copied, carbon copied it. Uh, no clue what the customization is going to be like. Uh, I was holding out, um, not watching any videos. Um, but I did hear it was in sports. So that's the only thing. So we'll see though. 1.6? Jesus, my money! Because I respect this car so much, I'm not putting it in my sports car's garage, being my office garage 2. We'll put it in office garage 1, because that's where the supers go. And I'll meet you guys when we get over there. Here is the brand new. It's in sports. Okay. So, yes. Seeing that, it is 23 options. All right, we do not have the wide body version of this car just yet, so I can't wait for that to show up. Boppers, 19. Carbon splitter, secondary forged, okay. Secondary forged, okay. Carbon winged, okay. And then all the variants of that. Then we have carbon street splitter, which is not bad. I don't, I don't mind it. And the variants of that, what else we have? Did I just miss one? I think I missed it. No, I think we're all still here. Carbon splitter. A forge race. I, I can't read. It's a, you know, it's, it's a lot of splitters. They all look kind of exactly the same. Um, they just one some have bigger wings than the others. What am I feeling here? To be honest, I'm thinking of a really just a clean look. Let's go carbon accents. You've got an eye for this stuff. Of course I do. Oh, I forgot about. We can delete the bumps. <gasps> do we do a deleted bumper? Do we do a deleted bumper? Ooh, you might do a deleted bumper. I'm not gonna lie to you. Let's go through the other ones though. You have carbon mid fin, carbon forge, carbon diffuser fin. No, I don't. All right. Yes. <laughs> XL. Oh, even Whatever bigger you if you want. <laughs> if you want. Uh, there's 19 options in this too. We have carbon bolt on. Ooh, that's nice. That's real nice. Forged, and then we have carbon diffuser focus. Actually, let me drop the car. We can actually see the bumpers here. Carbon race. Um, not too shabby. I don't, they're really not changing that much in here. Then we have GT spec. Forged. Uh huh. The forged GT spec. Uh huh. All right. Uh, yeah. Deleted bumper. <laughs> Let's eat the bumper. I don't know why. I feel like seeing this car with a deleted bumper just looks good. We're obviously gonna go with them titanium exhaust. I'm not even gonna entertain reading the rest of these. We already know. <laughs> Look at the street exhaust. Do you see that? Oh my. No way. I was gonna say, there better be a titanium version of these. Titanium turbo exhaust. Two turb skis? <laughs> oh boy. Kind of engine I like to work Absolutely. Carbon. What did it change? Oh, I love those. I don't know if I wanna change that. I love the stock grill. Ah, uh, I don't like the openness. It looks, it feels weird. Okay, primary vent, forge vent, primary vent with the canards. Okay, and we have the variants of those. Vertical. I. I think the vertical actually makes it look more like the. Am I wrong? I think I might be wrong on that. I know. I think that makes it look more like the actual. All right. Or, or um, then we have that the vertical kit with. Oh, it's, what in the wing tactic carbon fin? What is that? Definitely a no for me. If you want to have the ultimate racing vehicle or like the ultimate like craziest looking uh, R8, there you go. You could just slap these on, put some crazy in the back. Yeah, you can. Um, I kind of want to just keep the, the the normal. I love the vents. I'm not gonna lie to you, those vents were kind of fire. They're already carbon, so I'm just gonna keep how it is. Hood, carbon. Wow, so that's a big hood. Uh, forge ridge line, carbon again with ridge line, carbon vent. There we go. Get a little vent action. I like dig, dig that. There we go. I can do it. Ooh, that's a nice clean hood there. Is there a vent there too? There is a vent. Okay. 
I like the side vents here, going right over the two headlights. That's nice, that's nice. Um, I don't like these hoods. I, I'm just not gonna lie to you. I think maybe on JDM they look cool. Maybe like a Honda two, uh, S2000, something like that. Yeah. Those, those would look cool. How many cars um, got in this unless I just mix the actual car and then the car from inside this game. Um, I like that vent. Race hood's nice. And then race hood's forged. Um, I kind of like that clean hood. I'm not going to lie. This is pretty good. I like how smooth that is. But I did like this. I do like this hood. No, oh, we're going to go with this one. No. Did I just miss it? I swear I missed it. I did. Okay, I don't know where stuff is no located. Here we go. I want this. Oh, we don't care about horns. <laughs> um, Xenon, yeah. Full layout. And I'll do Lush and Blue for some reason. It has to be that. Liveries. You already had Jackal Racing. We have German. German Motorsport. Okay. Half camo. Oh, no. There's a half camo design. <sighs> Dang. Oh. oh, no. I do love a half camo. I'm one of those people who actually... I actually like the off-centered camo. Like, what's more Life towards... Like the passenger side, and you flip the camera on that side and move it like right over to the seat. Maybe that would be pretty good. Obviously, you have none, so the naked R8, nice. White stripes, black stripes, you gotta have those. The tri color, because you know, German. Um, white pinstripes, that's just nice and clean. Anything on the bumper area? Yeah, there is stuff on the bumper area. Red pinstripe. Ooh. <laughs> what is it? Making decisions is stressful. Kisima? Kisima. Kisima 10F. Dude, that looks sick. I'm not gonna lie to you. The Kisima looks fire. <laughs> Kisima looks good. That with a blue might look menacing. Maybe go with the blue? We might go with this and go with a the blue. Then have the uh, carbon, you know, accents. That might, that might be fire. Then we have Jackal racing again. Um, um shh, the Kisima's kind of fire. I can't lie. The Kisima looks pretty good. We have primary carbon forged. Um, Stock. Let's go. Whatever you desire. Thank you. Whatever I desire. Do I have an Audi R8 plate? Are you telling me I don't have an Audi plate? Why can't we make plates anymore? That's what I want to know. I guess we're going to lead that. My favorite place to begin with is. Oh, wait. <laughs> you can't even see the plate because there isn't one. So who cares? I kind of do. Uh, respray. This is what I want to get to here. Metallic. I want to see what does. Ooh, hoo, hoo. that looks good. Um, oh, a little ye a do yellow? Yo, that looks crazy. I like that do yellow. Let's go to blue real quick. I want to see the blues. Lime green. That do yellow looks crazy. I like that the do, do yellow. Drink? Ooh, Saxon blue. Or <laughs> oh, man, this thing is menacing. This thing is angry. I love it. Ooh, a rich blue. That's beautiful. That's gorgeous. What do you guys think of the comments? Which, what, what, what color would you go for this car? Diamond blue? Diamond blue always looks good. I don't know what it is in diamond blue. Um, I think that, oddly, think long that do long. yellow looks so crazy. We're going to go with it. I don't, I don't know why, but I, can, I really dig how the do yellow looks. Um, pearlescent, do yellow. <laughs> I don't know how it's going to change that. Uh, trim will go. Do we go black? To be honest, it's already good with that. God, we don't need to change anything there. Roof. Roof fins, let's go. Primary carbon forged. Primary race carbon and then forged. If you can um, think it, I can do it. I'll go with the base one and go carbon. She's a beauty. Roof. Full carbon. Oh my gosh. Do I like a full carbon roof? I don't know why that looks good to me. It looks real nice. You might as might hate it. Um, we have the forge there. Ah, there we go. That's kind of what I'm looking for. I like. I do like that full carbon roof though. I don't know why. Probably because of the black on the bottom here, the the, the Kishima livery. Um, but I do like this as well. We might just go with this. Just so you guys don't get distracted, maybe. Uh, in uh, what does that say? Insert. And then we have carbon. That's real nice. Carbon inset. Inset? I can't read. Don't worry. I just woke up. It's all good. Ooh, ridgeline. We're going to ridgeline roof for sure. Ridgeline. Ridgeline. It's not even close. Carbon ridgeline. That's hot. Side panels. Ew. Who would ever paint the... I uh, know. Uh, we have secondary, which doesn't look good because of the metallic. 
carbon panels. You just go stock. The stock just looks better. Uh, skirts, we have carbon, secondary carbon, forged skirts. Probably gonna go with a, a, a nice, simple no rush at all. skirt here. Probably not gonna do one with the fin. Um, probably gonna do one of the first ones we just went through. Uh, super, was it super skirt? Okay. We have GT skirt. All right. Um, I'm digging just the normal carbon skirt. Just something simple. Don't need. Doesn't need to be crazy. Carbon wings. We don't need a wing. We just need a nice, like, little cute, 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 cute. What am I saying? Uh, obviously, it's a retractable spoiler, which we did not draw. I did not test or drive, so yay. Um, I'm just happy this car has fat tires. Because if it didn't have fat tires, it was one of those skinny ones, like they like they like to do. Uh, forge ducktail, primary ducktail, okay. Carbon, forge, primary, flat duck. Oh, you want flat ducktail, huh? All right. Making Ooh, decisions full duck. Stressful. Okay. If you have extreme duck, <laughs> I'm just calling it duck. Primary street spoiler, not bad. We need a big boy spoiler. We need crazy aftermarket. That looks really nice. That's That looks like the factory, uh, Factory spoiler for the R8. Um, what else we got? Carbon race spoiler. What is that? It's not big enough. What I don't know. It just doesn't, it just doesn't scream. Technology and budget permitted. It's the big one. The big one has shown itself. It's the big one. It's so giant. Do we just go dumb? I don't think we can though, because it doesn't really fit the car. Uh. Now I'm kind of. I'm now I'm kind of regretting. What do we do? Did we just go big wing? I think we just have, we might have to just go big wing. Do you need a yeah, let's go big Bubble wing. Let's drop that to the floor. Transmission. Turbski. Wheels. Street. Um, I already like the stock rims, not gonna lie to you. The stock rims are nice, but for this car, we're gonna need some crazy. Um, these are track rims. Modern, modern mesh. Looks pretty decent on this. Modern mesh would be good, but I'm not a level 80. I think I'm off like a level A level, maybe. Dang. What rooms did we go with? Hmm. I'm not too sure. I'll come back to you. I'm, I'm thinking if we're going to go big with no no delete, but we're going to have to go crazy. So let's get crazy. Well, uh, about going extreme, we went a little extreme, a little out of the box. I went back to normal livery. I really liked how it looked. Um, we went for a first five spoke pair pair of rims, sure pair of rims. Obviously, we have the beautiful exhaust that did not go anywhere because that was never going anywhere. Oh, we have the ginormous wing because it didn't make sense to have, you know, the deleted bumper without a giant wing. It just doesn't look right, I guess. And we obviously added everything else that I said. You know, I was trying to make it clean, and, and well, it's not clean anymore. It's more aggressive than anything. And it looked pretty good. Let's go test this bad boy. In the at the in the airport, yes, yeah, drive it around in the airport. Let's take it to the airport because I want to see the top speed, and then we'll drive it around, see how his handling is. Alrighty then, we're here at the airport. Let's go ahead and see if we can get this top speed going. All right, what you got for us? Please be good. Obviously, hopefully, Bruffy will give us a top speed uh no update because uh, uh, kind of want to know. I'm pretty sure I'm hopefully it goes on 120. I'm kind of hoping. Also, I'm kind of hoping this is the new fastest sports car. But then again, Rockstar loves their per loves that pariah. But hey. Uh, I don't know why it's in sports. It should be a nine but whatever. Uh, well, okay, we got 122 out of it. I do not want to crash. Um, this thing has another gear. It just it's gonna take a minute for it to get kicked into, but so far it looks good. Is it about to rain right now? How dare you about to rain in GTA? How dare you? All right, let's test up the handling here before I get ahead and get out of here, so you guys can actually go ahead and buy this thing, because I do recommend you picking this thing up. Do you guys like the Audi R8, or just in general, you just like how it looks? Plus, then it's going to be getting a wide-body version of itself later, uh, probably, I think, later this month, so, from Benny's. So, I would definitely, oh, highly pick this up. This thing handles very well. It's got very good brakes. And it handles very well. I'm trying to get up, I'm trying to get it up to speed, and we're going to start swerving, and I think that... Oh, yeah. Yeah! Alright, let's see how it takes this turn up here. I think it, I don't I don't usually do this with cars, but I love the outer rate. I already already so much. Gee! 
Sheesh. Okay. Pick it up. Pick up the car. Pick up the car. It's A1 sauce. Hot fire. Mixtape. Do it. I will see you guys in the next one. We should let's grab and share. I'm out of here. Jesus. Thank <laughs> you.